What's up YouTube? Back with another review. As you can see on the table is the Mossberg 590A1. Uh, I just took it out of the box, that's why it's you got the barrel um, off here. And I'm not going to put it back together because uh, I got some accessories. So, so first off, uh, we're just taking a look at the gun. You know, standard Mossberg. But mainly I want to go over the accessories first and then we'll, once it's all put together. Uh... Alright, so first up, G, G, and G, Mission Essential Tactical Weapon Accessory. This is the Mossberg 590 front sling attachment. Let's take a look here. Right there, nice, kind of parkerized, kind of matches, you know. Nice and sharp. Let's put that off to the side. It comes with uh, some instructions. Um, this was purchased on Midway, so shout out to Midway USA. They're always a uh, a good online retailer instructions so we'll get that on uh, next up uh, so I have the Magpul SGA kit furniture or whatever uh, but I wanted to have the sling mount kit so this is what I purchased type 1 SGA MOE <clears throat> let's get this thing out I just haven't opened all this stuff I was Purchasing throughout the last couple weeks, you know, building up my accessories. Uh, I didn't want to do one huge purchase all at once. So, let's see what this comes with. It comes with some instructions in here. Gotta get this, get this out. Okay, so yeah, there's some more uh, mount installations information which is, might be useful put that off to the side there's a little baggie with some of the components this is just trash now um, before I go any further this was the owner's manual uh, some other stuff in here a uh, little sticker it's kind of cool uh, this is a magpool sticker uh, so I went with the Quick Disconnect Sling Swivel QDM. So that's going to, I believe, go through. Yeah, it should go through the uh, MS-1. So here's also the MS-1 sling. Um, went with the uh, Stealth Gray. Just opening this stuff up for the first time just to get it all out and then... I'll do the uh, install off camera and then we'll see how it all comes together. So there's some quick instructions for the QDM. This little guy, he pulls up to release it, so. MS-1 sling, this comes in just like everything else in this package here so yeah really nice I like the gray so we'll get that attached later set that off to the side another magnet these stickers are just pouring out uh, some instructions here, we'll, we'll get to that. Okay, and now the furniture, the fore end here. As you may have already guessed, I went with the Stealth Gray. I just think it's going to look uh, look really nice. A um, couple uh, locking rings and then the tool to get the barrel off. And some more instructions in here. Set that off to the side. And the SGA stock. Okay, and it 
comes with, you know, the little spacers that kind of look like little coffins. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll use any of these, but we'll see. So that's all you get there. Installation and this little mag pool. Oh, this is really, uh, I guess it's a big, huge catalog. That's pretty cool, I do have to say. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I'll set that off to the side, other side, you know, just more, more of their accessories, you know, magazines, they got everything, so there's that. You know, really good company. Heard a lot of good things about them. I, I've, I've been, you know, and I've used their stuff before, not like, you know, I haven't used them, this is not like this is my first time. I've, I've got some of their magazines from my AR-15, but, uh, you know, first time I've had this. So. Alright, so that is it. Um, there are maybe some future accessories I'm going to do, possibly the uh, Mesa Tactical, uh, you know, six round side saddle, and then possibly um, a light for the 4N, you know, with this M-Lock system, so. Uh, but, you know, I didn't want to spend a whole bunch of money all at once, so that'll be sometime in the future that I'll get those. Okay, so uh, we'll come back and we'll take a look at the completed uh, product. Okay, YouTube, here is the finished product, uh, Mossberg 590A1. Uh, with the Magpul furniture. Uh, I did add one spacer. Uh, I just felt that I needed, you know, just that extra length for myself. Um, there's the fore end. Uh, and here you can see the uh, GG. Let me flip it over. The um, sling ring, or whatever you want to call it, at the front end. And back here. I have the Magpul uh, QDM installed. So, uh, overall, uh, I think it, it's really nice. Uh, I like the tactical gray. I got the matching gray uh, MS1 sling. Uh, when I was taking it apart, I actually had to run to Menards and pick up a longer screwdriver because that is important for when you... Uh, take apart the original stock, so keep that in mind. Uh, you're going to need something of that size. Uh, just an extra part here. Uh, I do have a rubber mallet. You know, it's always handy. Uh, it did come with uh, the necessary tools, but it's always uh, good to have extra tools like a Phillips head and things like that. And as I already said, flathead screwdriver. Uh, as mentioned earlier, um, I you know I bought these accessories over. Uh, a few weeks and then I bought the shotgun and I just picked it up today uh, for the 24 hour in the state of Illinois but uh, you know future will probably uh, do a light install perhaps and also the side saddle I'm looking at the Mesa Tactical other than that though um, uh, I'm looking forward to taking this to the range and uh, you know Mossberg I, I've shot these before uh, in the military so you know I know what to know what to expect but they are uh, I mean they're military standard issue weapons so that's why I usually I like uh, getting stuff like that you know just because it does have that standard but uh, anyway uh, that's all for now and uh, take it easy thanks for watching